Hi everyone, welcome to Book Cravings. If you are new here, this is a booktube channel focused on book collecting, okay? Today we will talk about The Silver Sword. This is a Folio Society review and usually when I film a Folio Society review I always show the book, I talk about some aesthetic details and I present the story. I hope you enjoy. First published in the UK in 1956, The Silver Sword is a novel by Ian Serrarier. It is considered a children's classic. In the US, it is also published under the title Escape from Versailles. This Photo Society edition is bound in cloth with a design by Raoul Allen. I personally think this cover is stunning. The cover illustrations takes us to the ghettos in Versailles, the colors, the silver, grey, black. I think it is striking. Everything about it is so right. The book itself has a total of 160 pages in a high quality cream color paper. I will show you in a few moments. So the quality is as good as expected from a book by Folio Society. Another great thing is that I purchased this book with a huge discount at a Folio Society New Year sale. I love the fact that we have a beautiful map as end papers. The map shows where the main characters are at the beginning of the story and the places they went during the adventure. It has a frontispiece and six color illustrations I will show you in detail during the video. And the artist is also Raoul Allen, the same artist who created the cover. The book contains an introduction by Anne Fine, a British writer also better known by her children's books. In 1942 Versailles, World War II is raging and people live in fear from day to day. Ruth, Bronia and Edek have to fend for themselves when both of their parents are taken by the Nazis. Ian Serrarier was a British novelist and poet, best known by this wartime adventure. I'd like to explain why this book caught my attention. Of course, I'm trying to collect some nice classic children's books by Folio Society, but I personally really enjoy wartime stories. I grew up watching a movie called Escape from Sobibor from 1989. It is a story of the mass escape from the extermination camp at Sobibor, the most successful uprising by Jewish prisoners of German extermination camps. I am mentioning this movie because I grew up loving it, and when I was 16, I had the opportunity to travel to Versailles, and you can imagine how different Versailles is from Brazil, especially in the winter. So, this trip to Versailles is stuck in my memory. So, I curiously was always interested in Poland and stories involving it, especially during the Second World War, and now we go back to the Silver Sword. The blurb sounds thrilling. It goes like this. Versailles, 1942. On a cold, dark night, the Bellic children watch in horror as Nazi stormtroopers arrest their mother. Now they are alone. With the war waging around them, food and shelter are hard to come by. They live in constant fear. Finally, they get word that their father is alive. He has made it to Switzerland. Edek and Ruth are determined to find him, though they know how dangerous the long trip from Versailles will be. But they also know that if they don't make it, they may never see their parents again. Their gripping story is taken from actual accounts. So, this is the Silver Sword, and I hope I'll be able to read it soon. I don't know if it's a story with a sad ending, which is not uncommon when we talk about wartime stories, but it sounds good and I can't wait to read it. Have you read this book? Have you heard about it before? Let me know in the comments, okay? So I guess that's all for today. See you soon and thanks for watching.